Yeah, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I would like uh, to introduce to you CTS Eventim. CTS Eventim has uh, two business divisions. One is ticketing and one is, is uh, sorry, live entertainment. Um, we are currently acting in 23 countries in Europe plus Israel. And uh, we were the first company in this industry back in 2001 who started uh, the, to integrate uh, vertically the value chain by acquiring uh, the majority stakes of the leading German, Austrian and Swiss concert promoters. That, that was very important for our success because we were able to secure our content. Today, we are selling round about 150 million tickets a year for more than 300,000 events. And we have more than 20,000 ticket outlet stores hooked up on our distribution platform. When we come to the economics, we are generating round about 690 million in revenues and 156 million in EBITDA. And uh, when we look at our market position, we are number one in Europe in ticketing, number two in the world. And on the live entertainment sector, we are as well number one in Europe and number three in the world. Uh, we have round about 500 million visitors a year on our websites looking for live entertainment, uh, live entertainment information. And one of our key factors to success is uh, our huge database. We have more than 50, more than 40 million customers profiled in our database all over Europe. So when somebody survived a hard rock concert in Warsaw, then we know him, and there's a chance of another one. And we have more than 10 million newsletter subscribers and more than 16 million uh, ticket alert subscribers. I will tell you a little bit later about this powerful tool. And you can see on the right bottom of the slide we are, how we are positioned compared to our uh, competitors, we have a seven times better organic search reach than our, um, than our competitors together in our core markets. Back in 2001, we started the digital disruption of the business by migrating ticket online sales the ticket online sales offline or the, by the ticketing business offline to online. And the irony was and still is that we are serving our competitors. We are competing uh, with the uh, ticket outlet stores and of course with call centers. Back in those days, 90% of the tickets sold uh, in uh, Continental Europe were sold online and ten per, uh, offline and 10% via call center. And today, all over Europe, 55% of the tickets are sold online. To give you an idea, out of our 150 million tickets, it's round about 40% concerts, 30% sports, and another 30% classical. And we believe that we will be able to see a penetration of online sales of 80% plus. And why are we that keen to sell tickets online? You can see on this slide, the overall t average in ticket prices in Europe is 50 euros per ticket. The average service charge is 12%. That comes to around about six euros per ticket. And a ticket has the same price at every point of sale. And uh, you see, when a ticket is sold in the ticket outlet store, 
the service charge is collected by the ticket outlet uh, store and Eventim is collecting one euro system fee or transaction fee. When the ticket is sold online, then we are not only generating the one euro system fee, we are also generating the six euros service charge. And that is the reason why we are that keen to sell tickets online. And as we are uh, a business with which is a pure economy of scale play, every ticket sold additionally online has an EBITDA margin of more than 80%. KISS, a group which just the day before yesterday performed here uh, in the O2 arena, very successful, and uh, fans love our content and we wanted to understand the needs and the demands of our fans much better than we used to do. And therefore we set up an information science department which came to astonishing results. For example, the typical visitor of KISS is male, he is 40 years old, he is in relationship with a girl and he lives uh, in the countryside and he attends hard rock and metal events and he is a regular attendee of sports events. And what we found out with uh, our information science that men who are regular visiting sports events have a high affinity to purchase musical tickets. Not because they like musicals, it's just a simple reason they wanted to keep her girl, his girl or their girlfriends happy and therefore they are buying musical tickets and not only a musical ticket, they are buying a gift wrap as well to have the right uh, presentation for their presence. And this is very important for us to acquire additional revenues. And there you see, now he's happy with his musical ticket. So how are we securing our online growth? How are we protecting to reach 80% plus in online sales? We have a couple of features. One feature is, for example, that, uh, we, that our mobile app is able to synchronize your iTunes music library or your Facebook preferences uh, with our content and uh, you will be able to see what's going on in the live entertainment industry. For example, the most powerful tool we have is the ticket alert system and the ticket alert system, uh, as a user, you are able to subscribe to the ticket alert system, your favorite artist, and when the artist is coming on tour, you are the first to know, and you have the possibility to buy your t ticket before the general, general on sale starts, and so you have the best seat, and when you are selecting the best seat, you will be able to virtually sit on your seat and see how your uh, view to the stage is. And I think this is very important for us. This all works on mobile devices and of regular PCs as well. And of course, uh, you can do impulse buys and put it on your Passbook account. And when you don't want to have it mobile, you will be able to receive your ticket via post and when you apply for postal delivery then we send you uh, an, a fan ticket what we call fan ticket uh, or memory ticket and it's four colored and it's very successful and uh, it's driving our online growth thank you very much